If you're watching this video, uh, it's because you are interested in the short-term scientific missions of the Coast Action uh, program. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about my recent experience as a grantee uh, within the Coast uh, Purple Game. Uh, I hope you find it interesting uh, and also useful. Uh, more specifically, my research stay was framed uh, within the working group too. This working group is uh, uh, focused on advancing in the field of uh, reactor design, upscaling, uh, downstream and economics of uh, purple uh, phototrophic bacteria uh, processes. Uh, as you may know, the aim of the scientific missions is to strengthen networks and also to foster collaborations between researchers and uh, research groups. And I was really interested in visiting the Biochemical Engineering Group uh, in the uh, Universidad de Nova de Lisboa in Portugal. Since I am really keen on the uh, research they are conducting uh, right now. Uh, they are experts uh, on the cultivation of an oxygenic phototrophs and also on the synthesis, the analysis uh, and the extraction of valuable products such as uh, polyhydroxyalkanoids, uh, glycogen, uh, pigments and other uh, uh, high-value uh, high uh, products. Uh, this is a field complementary to, to mine uh, since I have uh, experience in the scale-up and the implementation of the process uh, but uh, I lack uh, some fundamental knowledge. Uh, so uh, this research stay was very uh, interesting for my for, uh, for the development of my research career. Um, since I could not leave my work for a long time, I used the, the Easter break at the university uh, to spend uh, one week there. Uh, so I know it was a very short uh, research stay, but it was very intense and also a, a really uh, fruitful uh, uh, stay, uh, even though it was a, a short one. Um, during these uh, days, I was able to visit the laboratories uh, to learn different techniques. Uh, I met uh, some PhD candidates and postdoctoral researchers, and we exchanged knowledge in different uh, research fields. I also attended a, a meeting uh, of the monthly seminar series of the, of the group, uh, where I was able to uh, listen uh, to uh, some uh, PhD candidates uh, about the research that they, they were uh, they are conducting right now, and I was also able to deliver a lecture uh, to the uh, researchers of the host group. Uh, so uh, we uh, we the aim uh, to promote uh, the knowledge exchange between both uh, research uh, groups. So even if it was a short stay, uh, I was able to initiate collaborations uh, with this group. Uh, to lay the foundations for future projects and also to initiate a, uh, or, or to, to uh, promote a, a training of uh, researchers uh, within the topic of the purple gain costs. Uh, in this sense, uh, we, are, uh, we were thinking of uh, uh, maybe uh, hosting here in Valladolid uh, researchers from this group and also send some researchers to uh, the Universidad de Nova de Lisboa uh, uh, to gain experience uh, in this, uh, this field. We are also preparing a joint research paper on photosynthetic pigments, uh, something that we started to, um, to elaborate when I was there. And uh, also we explored uh, some uh, research niches uh, to uh, find opportunities uh, to cooperate in future projects. So as you can see, uh, within one week, uh, I was able to do many things. And I really encourage you to apply for a sort of some scientific mission, um, since uh, it allows you to live a unique personal experience, uh, but also it has uh, many other advantages. For example, you can meet other researchers, you can create a network of collaborating experts, um, you can acquire independence and uh, so problem solving skills, or uh, gain knowledge in related research areas. And all of this uh, will help you uh, to generate novel ideas, which is of key importance um, for your future uh, research career. So the application is very simple, and as you can see, very uh, really worth it. Uh, so just uh, go for it.